What's up you guys, this is Junior Trader and in this video we are taking a look at Reddit stock. So I have been receiving a lot of requests to do Reddit um, and so I thought of following up on this as the last time I did was a couple of days ago. So let's see what the price section is doing on this and uh, how low can it go, right? It has been falling. So does it has a chance to go up or is it going to continue lower? Like what are those levels, right, to watch? So let's talk, up, talk about all of that in this video. Once I let you know that none of this is any financial advice, only for education purposes. Um, you are solely responsible for your own financial decisions and outcomes. I'm here only sharing my opinion, nothing more than that. So what we have with reddit here right we have been falling right we had those massive moves to the upside but we have been following uh, falling sorry falling since then now this is where the level of 43 dollars and 93 cents just almost 44 dollars i talked about when we had this red candle that guys just be careful here usually when this flush happens there's a chance it's just a liquidity grab and we can go up just like it happened on arm so if i take you to arm let's go back to um yeah here we go so with with arm what we noticed is we broke this level to the downside and the next day we had a green candle and then we formed this structure of double bottom and things continued higher after that right so is that something possible on reddit as well because it's in the same fashion right well i would say right now no it has moved past that stage so how is that and let's talk about that so why i say it has moved past that stage is because this is where um, we were, right? $44. We had this red candle. Yes, we had a good green candle. However, after that, we failed to have a follow through and we plummeted lower. So it just turned into a lower high and we are going down. So you, right now, that's not a liquidity grab. You can have the same argument over here, $41.79 sure but you need to see a green candle come tomorrow and recapture above $41.85 and should close somewhere up here um the thing is that i don't want to give this that good of a significance as how it is before because here we had a lot of price structure already built above 44 dollars so stop losses below this to have the liquidity would have been quite quite a lot here though we just have three days so i'm not going to give this thing as a liquidity liquidity grab too much significance but nothing is impossible right you have to still treat it level by level structural trading with the stop loss if the structure changes right so as for right now on daily interval as well we are making lower highs lower lows we are in the downtrend let's go to the hourly interval and let's talk a couple of things over there so what are you seeing on hourly interval i'm gonna get rid of this previous trend line we don't need that yeah so on hourly interval we are seeing we are in the lower highs lower lows lower highs lower lows right and the structure only would change to the upside if reddit tomorrow can break above 41.74 cents if it breaks above that intraday structure may change for coming days then the next level to the upside is 44 dollars that will be a change of structure but not right now I'm just seeing a downtrend. It may try to go up if the price action starts rejecting at $41.74, this significant level. This thing will just continue lower, right? And can make lower highs, lower lows still because that's the direction it is in. How low can it go, Junior Trader US? Guys, since there is no previous price action down here, you know, the it can go as low as it wants unless we see a price action change, like a structure forming, consolidation forming, an uptrend becoming. Right now, I'm not seeing any uptrend on this uh, stock. So technically, it say it can continue lower. Rebounds can be shorted on this and can continue lower. And with the stop loss, definitely has to be on the other side. But yeah, that's that's how I'm looking at Reddit. Now, there, there's nothing more on this, guys. This is uh, pretty much absolutely it's in the downtrend. Nothing else you can do out of it. Also, if we can regain $44, let's say this week, right if we can regain 44 dollars yes that is a really good sign that you can expect reddit to go up 
um, but not right now. Not right now. I'm not seeing anything. There's some articles here I'm seeing. Let's see if they're of any importance to Reddit. Reddit. Um, Google and potential AWS deals showcase Reddit's critical role in AI and brand strategy. Reddit emphasizes the growing value of its extensive library of human conversations for training large language models and brand social. And guys, the audiences, I just can't believe Reddit is, <laughs> Reddit users don't make any money. Moderators and everyone, they have been keeping Reddit alive and company don't pay them anything, right? I am pretty sure. Like companies making money off of the work of hard work of other users. I don't know why users still post on Reddit. I don't get it. Like it's, come on, they're taking advantage of you. <laughs> Anyways, but let's talk about in the terms of Wall Street. Uh, the platform's 18-year collection of daily updated conversations across 1.2 million topics and 7.5 million comments, according to the analysts, positions Reddit as a prime resource for understanding diverse human dialogues and popular expressions. Alphabet, Google's 200 million deal with Reddit for data access underscores the potential for data licensing revenue. Um, with OpenAI and several Amazon Cloud. All right, well, you know, if Reddit can really... Again, this is just a forward-looking news. I'm not seeing any price structure change. So the news is, this news, it's just a news, take it just as a news. This is not a news that's gonna affect the bottom line. This is not an earning, this is nothing. All right, this is just someone is talking about, hey, Reddit is so good. They look, that's how they can function with these players. All right, Citigroups initiates Reddit ad buy rating with $53 price target. This is an important one that I wanna talk about. And $53 price target up here. Sure, you know, well, let's, let's talk about this thing. Can this come here? Well, they, look, their price targets may be 12 months out, but whatever and th there's no guarantee their price targets are gonna you know um match right right now i'm not seeing anything in direction of 53 dollars price target i'm just seeing that this can continue to go lower unless and until we are not seeing any uptrend on this thing in the structure or structure change is not happening to the upside why should you buy it right if you sure if you believe no it's worth 53 dollars but let the structure give you some consolidation and an uptrend. So if that happens at $20, let's say, that's good, right? Because you got it cheaper and you still believe 53, sure, but you, you gotta buy them cheaper. So you should take advantage of downtrend if you still believe it's gonna go to 53 and see where the price starts changing in the structure after consolidation and starts breaking these levels to the upside um, with the structure change, not just that it breaks one level, but structure doesn't change. And that's why price action reading is important. So. But right now, guys, I'm not seeing that $53 price target to happen. I wonder if they ended up buying somewhere here, right? I wonder if they end up buying something here, somewhere here, and the price fell. They're like, okay, we got to get out at least in our profit. So let's go, okay, $53. Or maybe they bought here. Who knows? You just never know, guys, what is, you know, the intentions when, they, when these analysts come out with the price target. So that's why trading with the price section is very important. That's pretty much it. That. I want to cover in this video. If you found this video helpful, valuable, hit the like, subscribe, guys. If you need access to my tools, links are in the description below of this video. I'll see you in my next one. Take care. Bye.